Hey, what's going on? It's like a bear here coming at you with a different kind of video. So before I get started, I just want to say I'm not really big into drama in the community, but I feel like this has to be said. And I want to make it very, very clear. I respect Ethan, and I love his work, and I just really love what he does. But I feel like he was wrong in what he said about Counter-Strike and gambling and all that. So let's get started. So the first thing I want to talk about is how he accused cases in CS to act as a slot machine that entices people, especially the little kids, to go into wasting money and gambling. Now, I have to admit, in total I've spent at least $20 out of my pocket and $30 from a skin that I sold, but do not blame the kids. Blame the parents. I personally don't know any 12 to 15 year olds with a credit card and a bank account, so that money is either coming from a credit card or a wallet gift card. And who spends the money on wallet codes or keys with a credit card? The parents and guardians of the kids who just want a cool paint job on their Opera AK. And Ethan completely left out the fact that Steam has a family mode where parents and guardians can make it to where they can't access the market or other things without coming out of family view. And that mobile authentication is required now, so if the parents really did care about what the kids did, they first of all wouldn't let them play games that are rated M17+, plus, but certainly would not let them buy wallet codes or let them use their credit cards for skins or whatever else there is. Now needless to say, it was a really scummy thing to blatantly call out Trevor and Tom, but I agree that they should have at least said that they were using their own website, or just have used a different one for gambling. But however, I, it was still a scummy thing to do, and you should have just left them anonymous like a decent person would have done. Now on to the last thing. I feel it's a little shabby that he put the foop of it at the beginning of the video that was sure to be taken down, especially since he completely called out, exposed, humiliated, and doxed Trevor and Tom. That's right, he put Trevor and Tom's docs right in the description for everyone to see. But I understand that he was going through a lawsuit or something, and so a fund was started to help. But I think the video should be either removed or age-restricted because he clearly violated the terms of service by calling them out, therefore sending hate and harassment towards Tom and Trevor. And I'm going to ask you guys to leave a like on this video because if you put the little at in the title it in your Twitter account's link with your YouTube, it'll actually send that to... Ethan and all them that I'm gonna do. I don't even know who I'm gonna do. But thank you guys so much for watching.